Right, well, let me show you this. We have a Hyundai Tucson and it's a 1.6 turbo SE Nav DCT, which means it's an automatic. Now, today it's a little bit windy, so I hope you can hear my commentary, but let me take you around this car. So on the front, as you can see, we've got daytime running lights. We've also got front fog lights um, on that. Coming round to the side, as you can see, you've got these nice alloy wheels on the SE Nav. You also had uh, color-coded door mirrors, as you can see on that one. Privacy glass at the back. Then as we come round to the rear, you've got that rear spoiler and you've also got the shark's fin aerial there. We've got reversing camera and we've got reversing sensors. And then you've also got those twin exhausts because that's the uh, uh, because you've got the 177 brake horsepower engine in it. Right, let's show you the boot. So as you can see, rear parcel shelf there. Let's just put that back there. And as you'd expect for the Tucson, it's a really decent sized boot. You can enlarge it using that 60-40 split at the rear there. And let's just show you underneath here because we've also got a space saver spare wheel, which is rather nice. Now this particular car, it's a two owner car. Um, we've done all the servicing on it, so we've known it for the whole of its life. And it's finished off in this nice micron gray. And I think as you can see, the car has been very well kept. Let's take you in and show you the interior now. So nice, decent size, as you can see, you've got a center armrest there, and then you've also got ducted uh, ventilation to the back and there's a power point down there as well. The car comes uh, with two remote control keys. Now we've also got four electric windows. We've got electric uh, door mirrors, uh, and those are folding door mirrors as well, and you control your central door locking button from here. On the driver's seat, you've got, as you can see, height adjustment, and then the little button behind is electric lumbar support that builds up in your back. So I think you can see nicely kept and in this uh, practical dark grey. Right, let's show you more things. So the car has lane departure warning system on it as well, just to keep you safe. So the mileage, as you can see, basically 36,000 miles. So uh, not bad for this, uh, for this age of car. Now you've also got auto lights and auto wipers on this, and then you've got leather steering wheel and leather gear stick. So to show you, let's show you what else we've got. So on the right hand side here, We've got cruise control and we can control your trip computer. On the left hand side, it's a uh, Bluetooth and you can control your media center. So let's show you the media center. So this is the home screen. So it's set up on the left hand side with the satellite navigation, uh, your DAB radio, and then you've got all the menus because this car does have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto as well. Let's just pop her into reverse so you can see the reversing camera. There we go, making parking nice and easy. Below that, um, we've got, then got climate control air conditioning and it's dual zone, so you can control the temperature on either side of the car. Let's just show you what I mean. So I can reduce it down as you can see on there. Below that, we've then got a couple of power points and we've got our auxiliary and our USB. I mentioned before it is an automatic, so it really drives very nicely with that 177 brake horsepower engine. The uh, two marry very, very well. Just next to the gear stick, we've also then got driver's mode. You've got hill descent, you can turn the engine start stop off and you can also turn the parking sensors off if you wish. This car was registered in 2018 and that means you've still got manufacturer's warranty going through until 2022. And I hope this brief video gives you a good idea of the vehicle. If there's any more information you require or you'd like us to do a personalized video, we're happy to do that for you. Thank you.